Hello and welcome to a couple of rides. I'm Nitin and today we're going to discuss carbon fiber helmets, namely the Royal Enfield and the LS2 carbon fiber. I'm sure you guys have not heard of these helmets. I also heard about them for the very first time. So discuss it. But before we go please like, share and subscribe the channel and do not forget to comment and press the bell icon because that helps us create more videos for you. So, let's go So, carbon fiber is what Carbon fiber is a fiber composite material which is resins and carbon ke, uh, you know, fibers. Ko mila ke jata hai. It's tougher than steel and it's, it's very very lightweight. So, its applications you can understand in space tech, mein, medical, mein, racing, mein hai hi, and automobile ke kafi parts aajkal, carbon fiber ke banne lage hai. and for us bikers uh, you know it, 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 it is a two way process that it helps us if it is a helmet in application it is very light and uh, strong and if you talk about automobile segments mein agar iski baat kare, to less uh, weight equals to more power basically so which is why a lot of automobile enthusiasts and lovers when you talk about carbon fiber to them, they salivate out of their brains because, because lighter gives you more power. So now carbon fiber is coming, it's big, so let's go and compare the helmets. Helmets. First, we will talk about build and texture. So in the LS2 carbon fiber, it has a proprietary LS2 carbon fiber weave. If you look at it, these are very small blocks of carbon fiber. Ke. It's, it's not the usual carbon fiber uh, wraps and the carbon fiber finishes that we end up seeing. On the other hand, <clears throat> Royal Enfield ka texture is very very regular which we usually see as carbon fiber. This is a very regular weave of carbon fiber but it, it is very nicely made. और बिल्ड की अगर बात करें तो बिल्ड काफी अच्छा हुआ हुआ है इसमें एक दो और तीन वेंट्स हैं यहाँ पे और मल्टीपल लॉकिंग मैकेनिज्म्स हैं I also get in the visor I also get anti fog material anti fog uh, you know spacer I don't know what you call it I think we call it pin lock so yeah anti fog uh, um, uh, this thing the pin lock is there in it and uh, Overall, it's a very finished and a very light material. Overall, ये बहुत अच्छा helmet है. इसमें मुझे best part क्या लगता है कि जो ये uh, sport touring threads अगर बोले, तो इसमें बहुत अच्छे हैं क्योंकि इसमें ये touring screen, touring visor भी आ जाता है. I think she also likes the helmets. <laughs> so, uh, so. This makes a very nice uh, touring helmet for me. Can I take this? Okay. But on the other hand, this only has two vents. One here and uh, one on the top which are not connected. They are to be operated differently. This uh, is also a light helmet, a very comfortable helmet. Its build quality is not bad at all for the price it is, which we will discuss in a while. Comfort ki baat kare, to this is a 1300 uh, grams helmet. That is almost a 1400, uh, 1450 gram helmet. Comfort factor, I find this the most comfortable. It is the most silent helmet. Plus the, the uh, sun visor gives me a very nice support while touring and I've toured almost 3-4 hill rides on this and this comes out shining. Ek to, it, it just doesn't give you a headache. It's very light, hai, kafi tak pen sakte hai, and then uh, the added advantage of uh, multiple vents that it has. But if you talk about this, so ye, is more of a daily driver sort of a uh, you know helmet it's not i i would not recommend that you use it um, on tours and stuff like that but it's not bad you can i have an option of using that so i i usually use that but this on touring will also shine very very nicely otherwise when i use it daily it's got a nice 
chin support which is lesser in the uh, you know in the ls2 version this has a very nice thick chunky uh, support and that helps me a lot i think kitty also likes it you want to get in that so that is all about comfort let's move to the other one ab aa jaate hain price pe so the ls2 was for about 17500 rupees and uh, again it has value for that 17500 rupees because of many many things ek to isme pin lock as standard hai sun visor as standard hai it's lighter plus the added safety of uh, quick release pads in case somebody meets with an accident you can pull these and the quick release pads will pop out if the rider is unconscious helmet removal bahut bahut aasan ho jata hai so ye uska ek safety part hai jo bahut acha mujhe lagta hai is basically you can regulate the wind in this this helmet because it has three stage uh, inlets bahut acha wind control ho jata hai so this function very nicely in all weathers for me but iska visor is for 1700 rupees and i believe mere visor almost se 6 se 8 mahine mein hamesha ek visor usage ho jata hai to ye then in a regular basis costs you slightly more but obviously it gives you that much performance as well can we keep it here Kitty really likes this helmet, so we shall use it. On the other hand, this is a six thousand five hundred rupee helmet, and उस हिसाब से अगर मैं आपको बोलूँ तो ये best price uh, for the quality and the performance. वो कहते हैं ना bang for the buck. ये वो deliver करता है. ठीक है. इसका visor is is damn cheap. It's a three hundred four hundred rupee visor. It's it's not it's not uh, gonna affect me if I use it in an everyday basis. and obviously i'm going to tour with it as well so i'm i'm going to use it everywhere uh andar se isme koi crease nahi hai but the comfort padding is very very nice there is also a chin uh, uh spacer sort of a net which also keeps it this uh, slightly handy slightly warm but this is a airy helmet it's not a very uh, you know soundproof helmet इसमें साउंड थोड़ा सा ज्यादा होता है आई हैव अ कंपैरिजन पॉइंट व्हिच इज आई एम सेइंग दिस इज नॉट एज इंसुलेटेड एज एज द एलएस2 हेलमेट वर्सिटिलिटी की अगर बात करी जाए तो मुझे लगता है कि ये वाला हेलमेट ज्यादा वर्सिटाइल है बट इट आल्सो देन कॉस्ट्स मोर बट वैसे ऑन अ डेली पर्पस हेलमेट दिस इज अ वेरी नाइस वर्सिटाइल हेलमेट Uh, मेरा खरीदने का उपलक्ष्य यही था दैट आई विल यूज इट एवरी डे एंड आई विल यूज दैट स्लाइटली लेस और और ऑन वेरी स्पिरिटेड राइट्स व्हेन आई वांट टू डू आई शैल यूज दैट हेलमेट बट वर्सेटाइल आई थिंक दोनों ही हेलमेट है ये मुझे यूज डेली यूज करने में परेशान नहीं करेगा बिकॉज इट्स इट्स स्लाइटली चीपर एंड इसके मेंटेनेंस कॉस्ट एंड अदर थिंग्स आर चीपर इसीलिए मुझे लगता है कि uh, अगर कॉस्ट uh, फॉर परफॉर्मेंस और कॉस्ट फॉर वर्सेटालिटी देखें तो हाईएस्ट कॉस्ट फॉर वर्सेटालिटी इसमें है एंड देन इन दैट ऑल दो ऑल दो दैट हेलमेट आई फाइंड मोर कंफर्टेबल ऑब्वियसली सत्रह हजार रुपए देने के बाद इट्स ऑब्वियसली मोर कंफर्टेबल इट्स द पैडिंग इज बेटर ओवरऑल द फिनिश इज गुड सो ऑन एंड सो फॉर्थ बट छह हजार पांच सौ में इट्स नॉट अ बैड हेलमेट अब आ जाते हैं अपने लास्ट क्वेश्चन पे कि डू यू गाइज नीड अ कार्बन फाइबर हेलमेट आप मेरे से पूछोगे तो डेफिनेटली एवरीबडी शुड रन ऑन कार्बन फाइबर बिकॉज एक तो ये बहुत लाइट हेलमेट्स है यार ये दीज आर नॉट दोज हैवी यू नो दो किलो का बट्टा ऑन योर हेड दीज आर लाइटर हेलमेट्स एंड ओवरऑल जब आप सस्टेन राइडिंग करते हैं तो हल्के हेलमेट ऑलवेज ऑलवेज आपको यू नो फटी कम करेंगे आपका सर कम दर्द होगा और हेलमेट के जर्क्स कम आएंगे तो मुझे ऐसा लगता है कि कार्बन फाइबर हेलमेट्स सबको यूज करने चाहिए फॉर्चुनेटली फॉर अस कंपनीज लाइक एक्सॉल कंपनीज लाइक एस एम के एल एस टू यू नो एच जी सी एंड रॉयल एनफील्ड आर मेकिंग गुड एंड डिसेंट हेलमेट्स दीज डेज 
गॉन वॉज द डेज जब बहुत कम हेलमेट यहाँ पे आते थे और बहुत ज्यादा महंगे होते थे और इम्पोर्टेड हेलमेट तो आपको पता ही बहुत महंगे है बट अब इन कंपनीज की वजह से कार्बन फाइबर हेलमेट्स थोड़े से अफोर्डेबल हो गए थोड़े से बजट फ्रेंडली हो गए यूजेबल हो गए तो मुझे लगता है हम एज एन ऑडियंस डूइंग एन एवरी डे राइड टूरिंग राइड स्पिरिटेड राइड यू नो टू दिल्स एंड स्टफ लाइक दैट मुझे लगता है कि बहुत बहुत कामयाब रहेगा एक कार्बन फाइबर हेलमेट आपकी कलेक्शन में वेर यू गो फ्रॉम देयर इज अ चॉइस आई लीव टू यू so on this informative note this is couple of rides signing off and that is tiri busy licking herself bye